So a lot of events going on and good news, the weather pattern is going to cooperate. So I'm tracking abundant sunshine, mild temperatures as well, slightly above where we should be. Some of us could be climbing anywhere from five to 10 degrees above normal today. Right now I'm tracking not really much happening across the mid-Atlantic region. You can see some mid to high level clouds out towards our west, but we're dry out there this morning. So no, you do not need those windshield wipers going as you head out on your morning drive. If you are heading out early this morning. Uh, right now, our current temperature downtown sits at 30 degrees with a wind very light out of the west northwest around five miles per hour. And that westerly wind flow is going to stick around throughout the afternoon. So when we deal with those down sloping winds off the mountain ranges up to the north and west, that'll help warm the air. So we're looking to be slightly milder than yesterday. You can see outside right now temperatures all across central Maryland, mainly hovering in the lower to mid 30s. 36 is actually the warm spot in Stevensville, 30 downtown and Westminster. Good morning to all of you sitting at freezing this morning. So if you are heading out and about, make sure to grab that heavy coat to definitely keep you warm. Also grab that hot cup of coffee too. Uh, we're likely going to stay in the lower 30s right around BWI through the 8 o'clock hour before we make it back up into the mid 30s uh, right around 9 o'clock. But the MLK Day Parade is looking bright and beautiful right around the time the parade begins. Temperatures should be hovering and kind of flirting with that 50 degree mark. You do not need the rain gear today. Again, winds will be very light, so that's going to help us climb to right around 52 degrees getting into the afternoon. So take a look at future cast. Not really much happening across central Maryland. We are going to keep conditions dry. Some clouds will start to build in through the region overnight as an area of low pressure moves in from the Great Lakes. So this is going to help spark up some sky scattered rain showers in the morning, especially along I-95. And then those showers could become a little bit more widespread as the morning goes on before they start to taper off right around lunchtime. And then we dry things out for the second half of your Tuesday. So looking at your seven day forecast, a high of 52 degrees today, we drop off right above freezing as we head overnight into your Tuesday morning, dealing with that chance for some morning rain showers as the kids head out to school tomorrow morning. They will need the rain gear. You will need those windshield wipers going as well. Overnight, we drop off to 40 degrees into your Wednesday, milder and breezy as we head into the middle part of the work week. Look at this. We could be topping out and flirting near that 60 degree mark, an overnight low of 41 into your Thursday, and then there is that chance for more widespread rain for your Thursday afternoon and evening. Winds will start to kick up for Friday. A cold front slides through, knocks our temperatures down a little bit more seasonal in the upper 40s and the lower 50s this weekend. Mark. Thanks, Stevie. All across.